Good evening, dear viewers. My name is Tim, and I'd like to welcome you to our episode of Behind the Legends. This week, we'll be looking at a fairly recent legend, but even this legend is in no way inferior to the older ones in terms of its ugliness and brutality. Light a candle, make yourself comfortable, and look forward to a little horror. Today, we dare to look behind the legend of Argus. legend that is extremely difficult to categorize. Its increasing popularity makes it almost impossible to distinguish between fiction and genuine eyewitness accounts, but I have dug deeper for you and I have come to the conclusion that there are serious and gruesome reports here too. Let's first look at the background. Argus is described in many different ways, as a scrawny, long creature made of skin and bones, as a giant covered in muscles, as a little girl, or as something almost animal-like with little human features. All these descriptions have one thing in common, Argus's face or entire body is covered in eyes. So what exactly is this creature? Where does it come from? And well, words motivations. What exactly Argus is, is impossible to answer. What we do know is that it has an insatiable hunger for eyes. Argus prefers to prey on young women, but there are also records of male victims. So, male viewers, you are not safe from Argus either. What exactly is the M.O. of Argus? The creature supposedly has tentacles on its hands, which are scorching hot. These slowly thread behind the victim's eye, while the victim suffers incredible pain, thus removing the eyes. The tentacles burn an X into the victim's eye socket. These torments, my god, must be hellish. That was my first part in Argus. I will continue to keep an eye on this topic, and if there are any updates and new developments, I will, of course, inform you here on my channel. I'm glad you've been watching. I'm glad you could join us. I'll see you in the next episode of Behind the Legends. You are not safe from Argus either.
Thank mm-hmm. you.